Hey, what's up, Heart Garbage Squad? Foxy back with another video. Like you guys voted in the community page, or if you haven't already, make sure you check out the community page for updates. You guys wanted to see more how to build videos. So today, a newly patched buffed unit is the Iliana. So some of you guys are probably wondering what has changed. Essentially, this skill now gives immunity. It's a four turn immunity. However, this skill briefing Essentially, it's attack bar surge. So you put it on yourself and it becomes a three turn. And if you violent proc, it becomes even less. So now that there's another, um, another unit that provides immunity, but also provides the holy power to be, um, you know, unlike the invincible, it's actually a really great support unit and we're seeing a lot in special league. So you'll probably see this in RTA as well. So mine's built on violent will. Obviously, there's uh, there's two ways you can build this: swift or violent will. So you can use it in a very similar composition with Galleon, Iliana, and a Nuker, which is generally the Laika, which is a copy of the Wusa team. And how it works is the Wusa gets first turn, puts immunity to your team, and your Nuker Laika does a lot of work here. So how you want to build your Iliana is you want it, if you're building it on violent. You want to build it at a, a speed where it matches your support team for RTA or for Siege. So what that means is, let's just say your Molong Iliana. Your Iliana should go before Molong because Iliana can cast this skill onto the Molong and then Molong uses third skill and then Molong loses no HP because it's invincible. That's just an example of how you want to place your Iliana. You want to go first before you, it works like a Fran as well, you know, a very fast balanced Fran. It goes before your team to provide immunity or your team goes in first and then she goes last or in between to provide immunity depending on how speed tuned your units are or like what units you're using. So typically, um, you'll see here, she has a high defense as well, 749 defense. If you're building it for RTA, keep in mind, RTA, as RTA scales downwards, defense becomes more valuable. So you will see that I didn't go, like this slot here, I got a lot of defense. I didn't go all in on just HP. I have a good mix of defense here and HP. Another thing to note here is the accuracy. So it is important to have some accuracy on Iliana. It's not a big focus. Of course, it's a bonus. It's very nice to have. You will see here in the first skill, she provides glancing hit. In this patch, a lot of units got changed where glancing doesn't allow them to apply their um, skills anymore, like the Leo, for example, and the Hua. So having glancing, it's like a sort of a buff to her kit just because glancing um, came a little bit more powerful. So that's why I have a little bit of accuracy here, but you will see in front of my runes, they're not like the big focus. They're the things I just basically gemmed in. And well, Iliana, she's gonna be like a full support unit because of the briefing skills. So you're gonna be pairing it with um, slow units like a bulldozer to give it turns like an Olivia comp, or you're um, giving it to um, like a double support team where you can cycle cooldowns with briefing and you lower the cooldowns and you make it a lot more valuable or like a Skogel. Like I can imagine like an Iliana Skogel where this skill protects the Skogel and it's going to do a lot of work. So let's just see how some of these people build their Ilianas. So you have an understanding of how some other people outside of myself are building it as well. So you will see here, this person's got a really, really fast Avant will set here. So at this, like for a G3 at 169, it is considered on the slow side because uh, Thor is a thing, Ganymede's a thing. So if you don't have will in your Iliana, for, for RTA specifically, you're going to get countered from this, from like from not using this skill. And then if you get countered and you're not able to use those skills, kind of got wasted. So if you're going to play in a swift build and you're like plus 200 speed, probably most likely will not need the will runes. But on a violent build like myself here, 
I'm going to say you do need it. This one is just negative gaming. How is that even plus eight points? Best Iliana? I don't think so. The reason why this Iliana is really doo doo is because it has no HP. Plus 13k HP, that's just not enough. This is a blue rune here. This is a blue rune. And this is like a this is a blue six star rune. And it's not even grinded out. So this guy is definitely not the best Iliana. And he's lacking a lot of the like a lot of HP. If I want to fix this Iliana, essentially this rune is the problem. He has too little HP and too much defense. So in the scenario where your defense broken, your defense hot garbage only your HP is going to help you there so instead of looking at some of these people how about we look at some of our friends Iliana oh look looks like Tiger built one so look like I mentioned before you can build your Iliana like a Wusa on a swift build he even has it on a will set primarily because will swift Ganymede the base speed on Ganymede is faster than Iliana so that's one example here. Oh look, we also have Chuffles. So Chuffles, he's got a, this is like a mediocre Swift Will set. So he's probably got like broke back violent runes and don't got them to spare. So he's got a Swift set here. If this was on violent, it'd be super amazing here. So I don't want to expose too many of my friends here because I don't know how their permission, but obviously I know Chuffles and Tiger. So if they got a problem, they can tell me in my face, hey, <laughs> exposed. Anyways my alt anyways right boys anyways that's how that's how i give you an idea of how you want to build your iliana if you're gonna build it on violent i suggest you put it on will if you don't have will you can play around with the ai in, in guild war and specially sorry guild not specially guild war and and siege that way you can mid the ai and not get destroyed by the cooldown resets or attack bar reduction so you don't have a turn but obviously prefer the will and if you're on swift that doesn't matter so much so that's how you guys want to build your Iliana. And also, just keep, if you want to know how to use it in your team, keep in mind that the RTA um, regular arena will start soon again and can expect that unit being used because I think this briefing skill allows the cycling to be very good plus immunity, super fantastic. So just keep on the best replays and watch how they use their comps if you want to incorporate Iliana into your RTA team. All right, guys, Foxy out. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, and leave a comment of what unit you want to see next on how to build. Thanks, guys.